Hi, my name is Gerald Carter, and I am from Phoenix, Arizona. And my name is Liz Smith. I'm also from Phoenix, Arizona. And we just completed um, about a week the Street Children Project in New Delhi, India. So a few kind of highlights from our trip. We, we started with a pickup from our hotel. So we had stayed a couple days and one of the staff members, Diraj, picked us up from our hotel. He brought us to the house that we were staying at in South Delhi. He was very gracious. He was very sure to point out um, all the things that we were passing along the way and also took us to some local spots nearby to help us get oriented with the area near our house that we were staying in. We were staying in um, a house with a family, so Rajiv and his family here in South Delhi. We absolutely felt like we were at home for the past week or so, whether it was meals or you know just, just learning from the family, getting to know the family. Um, it was definitely an authentic way to stay in India and, and get to know the culture and the experience. Absolutely. One of the, that was the best part I think about, one of the best parts of the trip for me was feeling like a member of the family and we had said even within the first few days we already felt like we were residents of Delhi based on Diraj's teaching of the area and how comfortably, comfortable we were getting around the area, um, using the transport system, negotiating with auto rickshaw drivers mm -hmm. and after the time with the family and a great lecture from Rajiv about the local community, some of the historic landmarks in the area and the project itself, uh, Diraj then took us on the metro, showed us how to get to the, the project house where we were ultimately introduced to the children who we worked with for our one week here in, in Delhi. And the children were just uh, absolutely wonderful. Every one of them was so smart. You know, it took a little bit each day for them to get out of their shell and, and become comfortable with us again. But after that, the entire day was, was filled with children being eager to learn and, and showing off their artistic talents and learning new words and numbers and, um, you know, just, just having a new friend there to, to get to get to meet and, and they as eager as we were to you know learn about them they were equally eager about learning about America and and all the different things that life was like there so uh, it was definitely a, a mutual exchange they taught us as much Hindi as we taught them English and I, I would say a couple of the other highlights in addition to the working with the children themselves was uh, as Liz mentioned, getting to know the family here, Rajiv, his family, the staff here were tremendously welcoming and really gave us great exposure to what life is like here in, in Delhi and it's just something you can't get in a hotel, you know, going around the, the purely tourist areas. So that was really uh, rewarding. And then I think one of the other tremendous part was the people, the other volunteers that we met. We mm -hmm. volunteered with uh, a young man, 18 years old, from the UK and uh, another young woman from Montreal and both of them have traveled to different places but throughout the week that we've spent together we truly built some close friendships and it was just a, an absolutely tremendous time every day every evening so uh, something definitely we'll, we'll remember for I mean, the rest of my life forever yeah and the food the, food was <laughs> the other highlight that has to be mentioned um, the food that the family provided for us, whether it was breakfast, dinner, I mean, it was, it was delicious, it was healthy, it was authentic, better than our, our mm. hotel food, absolutely. So, and in terms of advice for anyone in the future who's planning on doing this project, um, I would say stay longer than a week because we definitely don't feel like we got enough time. We, we just started and it was hard saying goodbye to the kids after such a short time. So stay longer than a week. And um, I would say remember that your your experience with the kids and the time you spend with them is, is ultimately just about their, their confidence. You know, teaching is something you want to be doing as much as possible, but helping them realize how intelligent they are and how worthy they are is, is a big part of it that I'm glad I realized early on.
yeah, there were multiple times where we'd we'd ask someone about words or numbers or even drawing, and and they would say, oh no, I can't, I can't, and and after a few minutes, you'd come to realize that they spoke really good English or knew all sorts of words, and they were just incredibly bright children, and it's amazing how after just a couple of days of encouragement and uh, you know encouragement they they seemed so much more confident and uplifted and and that was the most rewarding part and hopefully that's something they'll take with them as well so yeah and then the other advice is I w also recommend coming a few days early I think being able to explore and acclimate to the city a little bit was was very beneficial as uh, Daraj then introduced us to this more local area that we were staying and Rajiv gave us a lecture on um, you know more of the landmarks in the area we felt like we were a little bit more familiar with some of the things they were talking about and that really helped us get up to speed and, and acclimate to the local area so um, but other than that uh, come with an open heart and open mind and it was it was a phenomenal experience and certainly um, incredibly happy that we we did this yes we feel very grateful we'll definitely be doing it again namaste namaste